unfortunately it looks like I'm gonna do. Retake the uh, the gates. So at speed! Come into tenses. Let's go charging in like this. As long as I retake the gates, then we can come spilling out. Where are my cavalry gone? Why are you doing that? No, don't do that. Now we just need to murder as many of them as possible. We seem to have made quite a nice roadblock here. The general's having a bit of fun. Good. Keep running. There you are. Okay, we'll take the walls. turned into a bit of a cluster here just at the gate. Like, this is our gate! No, it's our gate! No, it's their gate! No, it's my gate again. Ah. And these skirmishers can't decide if they've had enough or if they're just getting started. Yeah, I have a feeling there's going to be a lot of enemy units still alive. A huge amount I can do about that. So we seem to have killed everything up there. Cavalry just have to do what they can. See, this is why it's annoying that I didn't have enough cavalry left. Urgh. Yeah, one thing I would suggest, Murphy, is if you go to the Cyberpower website, then you can kind of see all the different components and like pick and choose what stuff you want. And then using that as a basis, you can then shop around, see if you can find that same laptop for cheaper, with like th those specs. That's one of the things I really liked about Cyberpower, is they give you that like laptop creation thing. I would strongly recommend a um, NVIDIA card for graphics, just because they're a lot better than AMDs at the moment. Beyond that, I can't really help you though. Pyrrhic victory, but it's still a sodding victory, and Stilicho did not die. And we did a lot of damage. I lost a thousand, but they lost 2,500. Not my best battle by a long shot. And there was a bit of a scramble there towards the end. But the Cohors and the Legio did their job. In fact, he only has three men still standing. Interesting. I didn't actually lose any full units. I will take the revenge one, though. So, Piane. Oh, you're attacking me with a fresh army. If it was just like an army like this, I'd be like, yeah, I might be able to do that. 600 against 3,500. Kill as much as you can. Yeah, they're out of the uh, sacking phase and they're into the we want your land now phase. Which is unfortunate. Meanwhile, Eastern Rome. What's that? Oh, that's in, yeah. That's England. So that's 1,400 against 600. Oh, this is a walled city. And they're attacking me with a lot of cavalry. Interesting. If I can use my wall onager to kill their onager, then I'll be pretty happy. Are these guys coming by sea? Caesarea. No, this is land. I 
That's a lot of cavalry. In fact, their front line is kind of shoddy. And we have the two layers of walls again. Which is good. They are... No, that's land. Okay. Um, right. Well, you three, first of all, need to be as close to... Oh, all three of you. Need to be as close to a landing zone as possible. Come on. Get that. Facing the right way, preferably. There you go. Wow, this is a very compact city. All of these towers are going to be shooting. This is going to be nasty. Alright, and then I also have a tower which I can place there. Well, hopefully you are in range of them. You are. Glorious. Yeah, that's the only position to really place you. Okay, archers. Archers are going to go... There. On what? Spearmen are going to go right behind the wall. Or right behind the door. Cohort. Will be a reserve. Defensive Testudo. And then the cavalry. Oh, that's not my deployment. Um, deploy there. And I still have a barricade, which should definitely be in the center somewhere. We'll barricade that one because it's the furthest away, so we need to defend just these two. That should be fine. Where's that little farmhouse? Let's see if we can hide behind the farmhouse. That's the plan! Oh, of course, it's one on a go versus four. Oh. We don't stand a chance. The, the enemy approaches. Uh, you lot, land. Quickly. Can't believe I forgot that. Uh, hold your fire. Don't want you wasting ammo with these guys. Because you won't kill them. I said, stop shooting. Burning oil. Oh, you know what I need to do? You lot need to be. can use the boiling oil. Stand ready! Defensive Testudo! Unfortunately all of their skirmishes are just standing just out of range. Scout Equites! Gates about to collapse. Our gates have been blown apart. Who? Enemy troops are at the wall. Thought they were shooting at the gate, but they weren't. They were shooting at this. Now here's the question. In Saga, you can't do this, but I'm wondering if here I can. It would be really nice if you could position units on the inside wall here and just shoot down. Unfortunately, you can't. Oh. Um. 
Bastards. Bugger. They didn't attack my cavalry this entire time, and now they do. <sighs> Get inside. Should have been doing that from the start, actually, shooting the general. That would have been wise. No boiling oil, either. Disappointing. Why is every map so foggy? Because it probably thinks we're always fighting in England. Adding to the general press of bodies here. Fire on the enemy! God give us strength! Let's get our archers to shoot that if we can. Now that we know that they can't actually knock this wall down, I feel a little bit safer about using it. Oh, you moron! Stay here and shoot them! Alright, just shoot. Uh, excuse me. This is my city, not yours. My men have given up and are running for their lives! Because now they're just going to go and steal the flags and win the game. The soldier with the horn loves his job, he kind of does. Alright, thankfully the towers are doing their job, okay, everything routed. So we're fine over there, they can't now capture it. Please tell me that you guys are shooting at them. The horn guy again. There we go. So why are you using fire arrows? Use no Orders understood. By your command. That's, that's the wrong exit. When I say over there, I mean over there. So I want you to come around the back and then try and hit them when they're running. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Ooh. Oh, that was probably the spearman. That's fine. Yeah, we outnumber them. It's usually a good sign. Oh, no, it was the cavalry retreating from nothing. Alright. They've been in a pretty bad way with these towers just shooting them constantly. I mean, look how many arrows these things fire. This is like the Gwynedd game, defensive battle after defensive battle. 
Yeah, but in this one, it feels like it actually makes a difference. Enemy units have been rallied. The general has been killed. Excellent. 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 I love how they're trying to run away through the city. It's not how it works, guys. It's not how any of this works. Praise the gods! Your victory is moments away! Just butcher everything in this town that you can. And then we'll call it at that point. Not bad. Almost half of the uh, garrison survived. Tier 3 towers shoot cannonballs. Not in this they don't. say that's good enough. 1,300 dead. They have 169 remaining and I hope that Onager is dead. Because that thing was annoying. Okay, the Archer's actually got 125 kills there. It's not terrible. I'll take the replenishment. Thank you. And then my army, which is on his way over there. Should be able to finish them off. Boy, that's going to be a lot of uprisings next turn. That's a second army. Great. We hunger for battle. For death and honor. Running March. towards the city. That does not seem like a good idea. Ready for battle. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, take the money for once. At your command. This army doesn't need anything Commander. else. And the general leveled up. He is replenishment. That would be super helpful. And then the integrity, sure. We hunger for battle. And you can go and sit in Caesarea. We may need to come and assist Constantina against this much, much larger army. Uh, Stilicho. Can't really recruit anything useful. Ready he did level up there. Uh, personal influence on the air is actually a good idea. Because unlike Gwynedd, the airs actually help you. Command. A radical thought, I know that is. And you need to recruit some troops. It is a great and glorious thing to serve your people. And you. Need to look around, see if there's any bad guys in Spain. The rain in Spain Ready for orders. does not fall in the plain or anywhere near me. Uh, Vizoncio. Do we have a rally field here? We do. So I think we probably need to reinstate a legacy here. Go with the master planner. Who will need to recruit some more troops? Soldiering. It's a good life. Stilicho can stay here and replenish. Oh, we could send you to go and attack that rebel army. I mean, this is a walled city. Walled cities are usually pretty good at holding. I think we're going to move here. So it could do with some reinforcements. Rally field here. Oh, the Protectors Domestici are the next level up. The Legio are actually low level. Oh, okay. And Federati are all the way up here? I thought Federati were like militia. I got that completely wrong. 
Now, the decision here is, what do I want? Do I want... Oops, um, something with more garrisons. Where's Varunum? Varunum, you are slightly behind my lines. I mean, there's a lot of hordes coming through, but they're not at war with us. And I do want to save a bit of money to try and improve relations in my big cities. You're building already. You guys are already happy. Africa is at a minus seven, but we are building the governor's house. Betica is actually almost happy. Magna Gratia. Hmm. Yeah, you're a problem. I think here we need to build for him. And then get like the theatre, the amphitheatre, whatever it's called. And you need to upgrade to a theatre. A theatre? And you probably need a capital. Because yeah, you've already got the waterworks. So we'll stick the capital there. Because that does give a lot of extra public order. Hey Scraper. Spain seems to be the safest place at the moment, which is a good thing because, like, half of my income comes from Spain. There's a reason that I keep investing in these top areas because these are the ones I'll be, like, fighting tooth and nail to hold on to. And I'd like those to be as secure as possible from, like, internal affairs, which is why I keep on upgrading their public order things more than actually just making cash out of them. Also, how are we doing in this? We're back down to 0.1%. So Celtic paganism is taking an absolute drilling. Are there any other food producers that I should be worried about? Venetia's doing it. Belgica's doing it. Lusitania isn't actually negative. Britannia, I don't care. Sequinarium, I do care about you, and you are really quite negative. You are good. How much do you need? 38. So a cattle herd would give you 80. Dalmatia. I don't think I can hold this. Because these two have been under attack constantly. If I can pull my lines back to Aquilia and then hold that instead. Yeah, because you've already got a garrison here. So, so long as I keep that topped up. Plus, we're building another legion over here. Speaking of building legions, are there any others that could get reinforcements, potentially? Ooh, local troops. We could get Germanic Hurlers or Alani Horsemen. Alani Horsemen are good. They're very... Actually, no, they're slow. But their charge is... Decent. Excellent attack against cavalry. My cavalry do get caught by enemy cavalry quite frequently. Not actually hugely expensive either. Yeah, alright. Let's get some mercenaries. And I always hate pressing that end turn button because that's when things start going wrong. have a skill. Uh, you are definitely a governor, so tax rate and then that. Also, just remembered. That's going from 3 to 10, so you're getting a plus 7. You'll actually be fine. All of you are fine. Africa. The guy in Africa. Public order. There we go. Construction costs minus 5% for military buildings. Research rate plus 3%. Weighted practice shield. Um, I don't have anyone in Belgica. 
think what I'm going to do is I'm going to add that to you. No, I'm not. I'm going to add it to whoever is my northeastern garrison. That would be you, Larsman. And you need to go and attack that rebel army Ready before they start actually spawning. Ferdorati spears are a slight spear unit, but they seem to be inferior to Comet Tentis. They are better than the Tati. So many public order issues. So many. Slowly but surely eroding our front lines. Yeah, the general in northern France is indeed hilarious. Um, this seems to be one sided didn't put you in the city. Regroup and fall back! At ease, men. He survived! <laughs> he went away and hid. And because it was just him, they were like, they can't find me. It's fine. 